Hey, what's up everybody? It is Barbara here checking in. So today I'm finally gonna be doing the little transformation on my Nike Hirachis and let's get into it. All right then guys. So these are the things I'm gonna be using in order to do the transformation for the shoe. I purchased these shoelaces on eBay right here. So I think they'd be fine. It came with a zip tie, but honestly I didn't like it. So I ordered a different one. This zip tie right here looks kind of trashy. And this is the other zip tie right here, which I feel like it's a little better material. So, I mean, it looks just a little better for me. Also guys, I got this. I was debating on using tape, but I feel like this is a little better. I'm just gonna cut it out into a little square. That way I could put it like with super glue. Yeah, I put it with super glue and then that way I put it onto the shoe somewhere around here. Somewhere around here in the bottom or somewhere here. Like right here or something. What my, one of my friends made this for me. It says air on it. See it right there. That way I could um, put it in place right here or somewhere around here. I was thinking about it putting it right here, but I felt like it's super, it's not even gonna stay on there. So I'm gonna put it right here. You can see right there. And if it comes off, then eventually I'll just do it with white Sharpie and I'll just put it in there. Who cares, it doesn't even matter. Unless I color this in, I don't know. I'll see right now. Also guys, I did order some of these. Um, they weren't that expensive. They were like a dollar and something for each. And I was debating on replacing this, taking off the Nike Hirachi, but honestly, I really love how this looks on the shoe. It really pops out. But if I were to do it, it would probably be look like this, but I don't know, it doesn't look too appealing to me. So first thing we're gonna do, guys, is pretty much remove these laces and um, try to make these fit in. I'm gonna, I'm debating if I'm gonna have a kind of like, just like a hangover look or just tie it up. So let's just take these off real quick and I'll be doing a, time left on it that way you guys don't wait like you guys don't watch the whole video like that for mine the 48 inches I believe these are 44 so they're gonna be a little I think they're gonna be a little longer than than what the regular ones are but i'll just try to make them fit some way you see right there it says shoelaces So right here guys, I am having a little bit of trouble. Like I said guys, this is the first time I ever tried lacing them up. So I'm just trying to find a way that won't look ugly. So the next part I think I'm gonna do that's super easy. I think it's just a zip tie. Just tie it a little bit. So that's uh, one of the steps right there. I also, like I said, I put the zip. I went back and I put the zip tie on there, and you see the shoelaces right here hanging out. Um, debating how it looks, um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them um, unlaced or laced. So I'll be debating about that. Yeah, guys, if you guys do get laces for the Hirachis, I recommend going with a 44. These are just a little extra, so I had to use one of the holes in the back. I might go back right now and um, try to make it a little more more like fitted or something it's just like i said guys once you put them on feet they're gonna stretch out so that the fit will look a little better on these all right guys so i ended up going back and fixing my shoelaces and uh because they were i had i put them on my feet that way i could try them on how they feel and they were super snug like super snug so what i did guys is uh, i went instead of because it was blocking like the harachi logo it was like way up here because it was down it was all the way to the back so what i did guys is i went three two holes two holes back guys so it has extra holes right here that way it just it just lands perfect like that you guys can see right there and i also added a zip tie so it's right there i had it on this hole right here but it no wait uh, i had it on this hole right here and it was dragging out so i felt like right there it lands super perfect and um yeah whichever way look goes in right there perfect so the next step guys is i am gonna be putting the air right here i was debating on putting it right here like the standard way you should be putting them like on the off-white looking version 
but like I said I feel like it wouldn't stay on there so I'm gonna be putting it right here hopefully it stays so with the sizing guys I I did go 0.5 and then on the length I did um, 1.5 all right guys so I ended up pausing the video because I couldn't get these little like the sticker off right here it was really really hard to get the tower right there I messed up a little bit but I mean I ended up putting the blow dryer on super hot and it ended up staying right there so you guys can see it right there it looks pretty cool I feel like it would have looked a little better right here but like I said guys it's not gonna stay right here you could just tell right away it'll just fall off so I think in my opinion it looks pretty cool right there and um, now guys we are gonna be cutting this um, the orange piece I don't know if you guys seen on the shoes it has like I'll put it right here a picture right here it has like a little center like a little square right there and I feel like this is really good right here so let's just start cutting this piece up and let's see how it goes so guys I cut up I ended up cutting up like the orange pieces right here it's honestly it's super hard just to do it but I feel like once you put it on it's just gonna look like whatever so I'm debating where to put it on on this shoe uh, like it's just like a little simple like stick on so I feel like maybe under here so maybe right there guys I don't know if you guys can see that right there I'm not sure if that looks pretty good I think that looks pretty good right there honestly but with the zip tie I feel like there's a lot going on in the center of the shoe look you, there's like I feel like there's a little too much going on we could also try it right here eh. don't look that good maybe in the back heel I feel like honestly you guys I feel like right here is like probably the best spot it's kind of hidden it looks pretty cool right there so guys I ended up putting it up here I feel like honestly there was too much going on in this little area right here I did decide I did debate on putting it right here but I feel like it was too far in the back and I feel like honestly guys like that looks like I just when I just glued it on I was like dude that looks like perfect like I felt I didn't know I, I just put it in there right there guys can see right there and I did use um super glue so any super glue will work guys not don't use um whatever the um, glue stick guys don't use that uh, I tried it right now and it didn't want to work so super glue is good and like I said if it comes off it's from the inside so nothing really happens to the shoe but honestly guys this looks really like I was like just excited that I did this myself and honestly it looks so clean like I'm super happy right now like honestly like I can't even explain it like I'm just like it looks super cool like to me and I do have these things and like I said guys I did want to put it inside but I feel like that's a little too much honestly honestly guys I was debating on putting it around here or something like that that way it kind of gives it like a like that kind of like that feel but honestly guys like it's super hard like you guys can tell right here I'm just kind of just struggling to put it in and I was debating on putting it like under like this cut it up into a piece but honestly guys, I don't think I need this. It would look pretty clean if I, I guess if I did it like this, if I cut it out, but I feel like in my opinion, I really like this right here. It just tells you what the shoe is. All right guys, so I pretty much, like I said, it's just super basic stuff that you gotta add on the shoe that I feel like makes it look like a little better. I did have the patch guys, and I feel like I couldn't put it anywhere. I was trying to put it inside, and I feel like it's just gonna ruin the shoe. So I don't want to overdo it and add too much stuff on it. So I feel like this is just simple and I think it looks really clean. But I also got to do the other shoe guys. And then after that, I'll put them on feet and that way you guys can see that little clip right there. All right guys, so I just ended up finishing the right shoe. So now I have both of them. Let's throw these on feet and let's, let's see how they look.
that pretty much concludes today's video guys i just tried something new i felt like it was just like i wanted to add my own style to like this is like probably one of my favorite like regular shoes that is not overpriced and i wanted to add my own type of vibe to it like i said like i try to copy the off-white and try to make it my own style and hopefully it gives you guys if you guys try to make your own shoe like some ideas so that was a clip guys i honestly really like how they came out like i feel like it's like it stands out i think this makes it stand out a lot but even if you just take it off i feel like it looks like a nice standout like it's just like it's not so so extra i was thinking of getting like green laces or orange ones maybe i'll do it just to like change it up but i feel like this is like super subtle right here and like i said this is gonna this is my barber shoe right here i was waiting like probably like two weeks for everything to get here the zip tie the shoelaces and also like the my friend was it was uh, making the sticker for me and this i just ended up buying it already it's a little sticker thing so if you guys did enjoy this video smash that like button for me also subscribe i really appreciate it and with that guys stay fresh it is barber here signing out